year begins the same way that last year ended against Vandergrift. For those who don't know, this, our game of the week in week one, is a fourth round playoff rematch. And if you don't remember how that playoff game went down last year, let's remind you with this video. It had more drama than an episode of Law & Order. Down by three with less than two minutes remaining. The Tigers went for it on fourth and goal. Though it looked like they got the one yard they needed, the quarterback sneak was actually fumbled, recovered by Vandergrift, and essentially ended Dripping's season. Uh, 100 percent. We we know we were that close and uh, I guess we just want to prove that we're still there. We were just so close. It was one yard and I mean that kind of motivated us all off season and I think we're just ready to go. While that goal line stop provided heartbreak and motivation for Dripping Springs, there was a sideline full of guys wearing black and silver who were jumping up and down because they were on their way to the fifth round. So what does Vandergriff remember about the play that won the state quarterfinals game? Something looked different from the beginning of the play, and so I was going no, even though I saw the quarterback's body go across the, the goal line. I mean, I remember thinking that they scored. I was a little bummed out, and I saw Diego running out with the ball, and I started going crazy. I saw Diego moving and I was like that's a really weird movement because he was moving away from the pile and with a lot of urgency and then I saw the ball in his hand and then I went crazy I don't even really remember the next 30 seconds because uh, I knew it was our game at that point every time these team plays it comes down to the wire tonight could be another instant classic